I mean, basically it's, you know, telling people what is, what is, but people think is true, making them believe that it's not. So um, trying to undermine what is actually true and what is actually valid. Um, and that is, that has happened a lot, you know, like we can just, for example, natural immunity, people were told, oh no, you still have to get vaccinated even if you were infected and recovered. Like we've known, I mean, it's a basic tenet of immunology. Once you have had an infection, you have immunity. It's actively inquired immunity. And to tell people that, no, that's not right. That's not true. That, that that's not a thing anymore. That is a perfect example of gaslighting and um, one of one of the many things that people were told over the last few years um, that just undermined people's trust. It undermined people. You know, it's unnerving to me, Philip. It's very unnerving to me. These people in leadership positions, the public health professionals who prayed, they prayed on people and they used fear to to manipulate 